Welcome back to Dave's MySQL Basics. Right now we're going to look at order by and group by. Uh, these can be very confusing to novices of the SQL. Uh, once again, I'm using the world database that MySQL is used forever for classes, documentation, uh, examples, and I'm also using the free MySQL workbench. I think it works better for uh, this purpose that we're going to do today rather than the, the MySQL shell. Okay, I have a simple query here. We're going to select continent region name from the country table. Uh, this has been commented out, and this, that's how you do comments. Order by continent. Now, without, without the order by continent, what we get, excuse me while I comment this out, uh, what happens is the data comes back in what looks like a haphazard uh, fashion. Well, actually, it's just pulling everything back uh, as it can get it off the disk the least expensive way. So. In this way, uh, first continent is North America, second one's Asia, Africa, and North America again. Uh, so it, it's it's not a guaranteed return uh, as the data goes in. It pulls it out the way it, it wants to, the cheapest way it can do it. So if we order by continent, uh, we basically sort everything by continent. Now if we also want to sort by region, we can do that. And now the region is sorted, and if we want to sort by name, that works too. Uh, if you want to change this up and do something in a non-standard uh, sort, that's something you're probably not used to seeing, something like this, uh, because it, we humans tend to think uh, great to small, small to great. Uh, so if we sort by name second, uh, you can see the name comes out. Um, uh, before the region gets sorted. Uh, usually not the way we look at things, but uh, that shows you how things can go. So, once again, run our, our query, and we have things sorted the way we want. Now, group by uh, is sort of like order by, but it groups things by a column. What do you mean by that, Dave? So, um, let me show you if I just do a group by. Um, we're only get information as by the various continents. And by the way, you can do an order by if you can type you can type it, you do an order by. If this is what you really want. So now we have the continents alphabetized, but that's, let's take that out for now. This uh, is kind of disappointing because you know there's a lot of countries out there, but you're just kind of getting the first one. Uh, that's the way the, the grouping works. Now, we also know there's lots of different regions. So let's work on the regions first. Um, if you have a group and you want all to show up in one cell there of output, there's a command called group concat. Whoops. And when we run this now, and expand this out, you'll see all our our different uh, regions out there. And since things do repeat, we can add in. Uh, what happens is every row comes back and it, it can repeat this information over and over again. So what we're going to do is we're just going to uh, sort it out so that the various, uh, like North America has all these regions, without um, using distinct, every record would put in its own region there. So this helps trim things up a little bit too. Now, if we wanted to get all the various countries there, we can also do a group concat. And when I run this, you'll see that the various countries are listed along with their, their region. So, that is a quick introduction to the introduction to the order by, which is sorting, and group by, which is a grouping function. 
on to the next lesson.